Hello, Mayday family. How are you doing today? For those of you that are new to my channel, my name is May. I'm a licensed counselor with a YouTube channel. Don't forget to smash the like button for the YouTube algorithm and also hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any videos when they come out, especially if you like videos such as this one. I'm so glad you decided to join me today. I wanted to talk about something that I feel like is a really interesting topic and it's actually come up for me a few times before. I've actually had this thought a few times before and it's kind of like a conflicting thought process so I wanted to make a video about it and bring it to all of you most recently what brought this back up to my consciousness and just brought it back up to my mind is I was watching a video and something was mentioned in that video about being in a bikini and being in a bra and that that particular video that I was watching, that particular individual is within an acting career. Currently, she's comfortable, you know, being shot in a bikini, but not comfortable being shot when she's in a bra. So that made me think, well, that's... <laughs> I, I, you, do you guys... You, you gotta love it when you get that one little piece of hair in the middle of your face and you think you know where it is and you keep picking at it, picking at it, you want to like take it out of the way, but you can't freaking get it. <laughs> that became just an interesting thought and I said, you know what, I'm going to make a video about this because I want to see what more people think about it also. I mean, when I think about that, I just think it's so silly and ridiculous. It doesn't make sense to me. I mean, if you're comfortable posting pictures, videos, whatever, in your bikini, then why be uncomfortable posting pictures, videos, whatever, in your bra? I mean, in my opinion, a bra covers up more than a bikini does. But is this just me? Like, I mean, I feel like it makes no sense to be comfortable doing one and uncomfortable doing the other. And the thing about this is I think a lot of people are like this. A lot of people are like, well, I would post in my bikini, but I wouldn't post in my bra, right? And I think that even I've subscribed to that mentality until today because I'm actually sitting down and thinking about it more and realizing how little sense that makes. <laughs> but as a society, we've made it to where it's acceptable to post pictures in our bikini, but somehow it's not acceptable or it's less acceptable to post pictures in our bra and underwear. And it blows my mind when I think about it because it's like they're, they're, they're essentially the same thing except for the fact that the bra and the underwear covers more. You know what I mean? Like, so how in the world did we as a society decide that, hey, posting in your bikini is okay, but if you're going to post in your bra and your underwear, not so much. It just, it's so ridiculous. Some of the things that we've put in place as, as a society, it, it just, it's so dumb. It's just plain dumb, right? And so, in my opinion, like, you know, if that's, if that's what you want to do, then, then do that. Like, I mean, I don't think in particular one way is better than the other so i don't think oh not posting is better than posting or posting is better than not posting it just depends on what your platform is about and so it's fine but i just feel like what is there to be confused about if you're comfortable posting your bikini then what's the big deal if you post in your bra like your bra and your underwear you're actually probably gonna get more coverage because if you think about a bikini and what that looks like compared to just regular underwear and I think the reason the reason this has this has happened in this way as far as like from a societal standard is because well of course with bikinis you're not then typically most people aren't then you know putting on a shirt and pants and then walking around all day you know I think it's the cognitive thought behind it it's not the actual action right it's not based on any facts it's just based on the fact that cognitively 
a bikini is meant to be worn out and it's because you're going to go to the pool or the beach and you're getting in water and things like that and so cognitively for the mass amount of people it's like well duh you know everyone wears bikinis out right and cognitively we have like underwears like bras and regular underwears but that's not something that we think of as being socially acceptable to wear out so it's more of a cognitive limitation than it is a factual limitation if that makes sense and i think that has a lot to do with why this is this phenomenon of listen like posting your bikini all you want to no one blinks twice at that but let me post in, in my bra and my underwear all of a sudden and being sexually explicit you know what i mean like it doesn't make any sense <laughs> so it, it it has to start with your cognitive mindset and it, it's because cognitively that's what we've trained our minds to not only be used to but to believe right because when we put on underwear for example we don't, we're not just putting on underwear like bra and, and underwear and, and walking out the door and going to work or whatever so underwear even the name underwear right so even the name leads to that cognitive mentality or predisposition of oh it's not meant to be seen even though if we really take a look at it a bikini exposes more than underwear does more than uh, a bra does you know it's a lot more exposed and you see everything if you're wearing a bikini right so it's even the name is is basically building on what they want us to believe and how they want us to think and when i say they I, I just mean society as a whole for the most part um and society as a whole it's the masses that kind of have a, a large role in dictating you know how we sway at any particular time so even the name underwear it's like it already gives you that mentality of like oh it's meant to be underneath something so if we don't see anything on top of it and we're just wearing underwear then oh that's so inappropriate but if you have shots on facebook your bikini yellowing it out that's cool you know it's it's silly it's so silly so it's from a mindset from a cognitive mindset i think that's where the bulk of this is there is no factual or realistic reason why that should be it, it really makes no sense actually if we think about the facts we should be more comfortable posting pictures in our underwear than we are posting pictures in our bikini because like i said underwear covers a lot more than a bikini does <laughs> so so you know it's just one of those things that i just started thinking about i said like i would wonder it, what other perspectives might be out there or like what other people will think about this the mayday family will think about this because that's where i stand i think it makes no sense cognitively and so therefore we have found yet another thing societal standard that have that have has basically been forced on us and through the generations continues to be reinforced and reinforced and so now we find a lot of people especially with social media really confused about like oh well let me post in a bikini with my friends but i would never post in my bra and underwear and it's like why your bra and underwear cover more than your bikini does you know what i mean so so that's my thought on it i think it's more of a psychology based rule than it is a, a rule that's based on facts or morality or ethics you know it's not based on anything substantial it really is a more of a followers mindset right a followers mindset because most people don't stop 
to think about why well that doesn't make sense this is this this is that they're you know so people don't really stop to think about it you just kind of follow with that and that comes up as a feeling and that affects your action that's how they've programmed you to think so most of the time we don't even realize that unless we stop to think about it and i'm with you i mean there's probably so many other ways in which this applies that i even do it because you can't help i mean a lot of these things will take time because you have to really sit down and think about it and be like, well, that makes no sense, right? So there are probably things that even I do that I, that I shouldn't really be wasting my time thinking about, worrying about as far as like, oh, is this okay? Because, what, you know, lo logically, you know, the answer is clear. So it's more of like, like I said, it's more of like a follower's mindset and it's hard to avoid because you do live within the society which of which you live. So um, you are going to be affected by that programming no matter, no matter what you do. But as you engage more and more in active cognitive processes, then you're able to um, basically start standing out from the pack a little bit more and you're able to take at least a little bit more control over your life and what you want to do. And so that's the conclusion that I came to. I think, look, why are you uncomfortable posting in your underwear, bra or whatever? Like, go for it. If, if, if you're selling that stuff, if that's your business or whatever, you know, do what you do, do what you have to to do or what you want to do and feel comfortable doing that you know like don't let people because people the same people that post all these pictures in their bikinis and stuff will be the same people posting comments underneath what you're doing talking about oh i can't believe you would post that picture of your underwear it's like uh, shut up you know so you know that's just my thought but you guys let me know what you think what are your thoughts on this what do you think? I mean, am I perhaps missing a particular perspective or something? Comment below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what your thoughts are. Again, don't forget to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm and hit that subscribe button if you like videos such as this. They're very thought provoking and things like that for more of them. I will talk to you guys in the next one. Bye bye.